channel. If you're having a problem creating your channel art or your channel banner, this video is absolutely for you. Are you the type of person that you've been trying so hard to beautify your channel but you are having so many difficulties in doing it? This video is mainly for you. By the end of this video, you're going to learn how to create those beautiful thumbnails or those beautiful templates for your channel art or your banners. So watch this video to the end and make sure you keep this video beside your computer or your phone when you're practicing because I'm going to show you step by step to create your template to the end so that you'll be able to do it by yourself and personalize or customize your channel art or your channel banner anyhow you want it. Remember, anything about your channel, your thumbnail, your channel art, all those things has to be your personality. It has to be you. It has to be something that represents you. So try to make your thing anyhow you want it. Customize it. Put everything. Welcome back and let's jump into the video right now. Remember, your channel art or banner is the first thing the potential viewers view anytime they jump into your channel. So that is why you must create one for yourself because that shows exactly your brand. That shows what the channel is talking about. That shows how that is what communicates with the viewer before subscribing because it represents what your channel is talking about. It represents what your channel is all about, okay? What you do with your channel. What kind of videos do you produce? What kind of things or areas or your niche? Let me say, what, what are your niche? Like, that is what your channel talks about. So eventually, the channel art or the banner is worth, you know, communicate with the viewers when they come into your channel to know exactly if they're going to subscribe to you or not. Sometimes you may not be having um, interesting niche or orders, but just because of how beautiful the um, the channel art is, how organized it is, gonna attract someone to say, okay, let me support this person, or maybe let me just subscribe and see what's going to happen. And that can person keep following you. Even if you're going to be monetized, you still have to put them before you got monetized because these are the first thing they're going to see when they're coming to do your review on your channel. So eventually, if you don't have it, they're still going to tell you to do it. So that is why this video is very, very important for you because I expect after watching this video, you go back and create and customize your beautiful um, um, channel art or channel banner. That is the essence of this video. So just this like video. your thumbnails is very important for your videos, but this one is just like uh, it's just like your jacket that you wear in winter. That is exactly what your customized or your banner or your channel art is to your channel. It's what cover ups your channels and protect it. So why shouldn't you, you know, do it in a way that is more presentable, beautiful, and you know, make that channel art to stay? You know, um, you know, warm the channel up. So that's exactly what it is. So don't get it wrong, but that is exactly what it is. It's just like you wearing a clothes. That is what your 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 channel art is to your channel. All right. So it's just covering and protecting the whole thing. Then, so I'm gonna take you on a very short journey on how to do it. It's gonna be simple, and you know, if you follow it step by step, you're gonna understand it and you're gonna do it by yourself. Okay. So let's jump in and start with the tutorial. <music> Before you start with your thumbnails or before with the template for the channel art, the first thing you're gonna do right now is you ask yourself what is involved. I think the first thing that you should bear in mind is dimension, just like your thumbnail. The banner has its own, um, you know, numbers, has its own um, dimension that you must follow. If you don't follow that, it will not fit in. And remember, just like your thumbnail, the channel art has a dimension because it's going to fit in three different devices. It's going to fit in your phone, in your tablet, and then in your computer or laptop, okay? So it has about three different sizes, but you try to cover up the three sizes so that in the middle one can always show on the phone, the second one can show on the tablet on the, or, or any other device that is bigger, and the last one that is more larger is going to show up on the computer. But where we're going to concentrate is on the middle one, because you make sure you utilize the middle box to make sure that you have all the information on the middle box. So that is what is so sensitive about your thumbnail, about your channel art, okay? So keep watching. Your channel banner or your channel art doesn't 
have to have any kind of gimmick or image that's video image or um, any other thing that is like just like videos you don't have to appear on your channel ad exactly just like your thumbnails those things doesn't function they will not upload okay and remember 2 MB that's 2 megabyte it cannot be more than that it's just 2 megabyte and these are the things you have to put into consideration when you're trying to save it because you're gonna use it when you're working on the site on camera.com when you walk in there you're still gonna need it for your real measurement okay because if you want to do it by yourself you're gonna have a kind of difficulties when uploading it you might just put it there and it will not size and that is why you have to get this other one before you go in but there's nothing to worry about even if you can't download this one to work on your site you can still go on on canva and work with your ready-made template you're seeing there because they already have some templates that you can change the colors or put some features that you want and you know to create your own um, um, customized um, channel art so there's nothing to worry about but um, I mean, there's other sites or softwares that you can also use to give you that exact measurement. But this is my system. This is how I create mine. And because your channel art is something that you can change it anytime you want, or you can, you know, adjust it just like your uh, your your profile picture. You can always add, or you can always and um, delete and create whatever. So you just have to have it at a thing. So before you start, what are the necessary things that you have to do? Number one, you have to get a real measurement or dimension for the YouTube channel. And because we don't know it or you can't not just figure it out, and because there's some other criteria that are very much attached to that tag. So I will advise you just go to www.youtube um, um, template or YouTube channel banner or channel art, okay? Then you're gonna see this, okay? You have to see this and what you got to do is just you know um, download it okay you just download it and now take it or save it to your phone or save it to your USB depending on what device you're using and then keep it because you're gonna use it on Canva um, site to you know to create your template so what I do is that I do it I just um, stamp it out I download it on my phone and then keep it aside but if you think that you can go ahead or you can figure it out and you have much time okay you can still go ahead on camera but for you not to be deceived or maybe not to be confused about the measurement and everything I would advise that you go to um, um, the Google and download the template the example of the template and it will just give you the measurement the real measurement that is required of you or, or the real dimension that is required of your um, channel art or your banner so I will advise that you go and download it from Google and then save it because you're gonna use so I'm gonna tell you some free software that I use to create my like you use it on canva.com you just have to create your account if you don't have account then if you have account you just log in and then start so off the what section of the project you click on the project and this page is gonna open up and the next thing you're gonna click is have you seen it the channel art is just there okay just on top of the thumbnail you don't click on that one and the page will now pop up okay make sure you click on that and it will now open and you now see you um on the template you already see that in um canva.com you already see that on canva.com the dimension of the channel art is already there the dimension of the banner is already stipulated already okay so there is no extra job you're going to do there but for you to be sure in terms of creating or customizing yours that is when the measurement or the dimension that you downloaded the other part is going to be necessary for you so now i'm going to take you on a long process on how to do it step by step on how to use that downloaded template that you got from google how you're going to use it on canva to create yours or how you're going to do it just without the template okay and create your thing and do your thing by yourself so now um, I'm gonna just take you on it. So this is how it goes when you get into there and you now upload it. What you're gonna do now is now you now you know upload those templates that you created the Google template. Um, you make dimension that you have. You now have to upload it on um, Canva.com. You have to put it there. Any picture that you think that you want to use and work, you still have to put it right inside 
there okay so what you're gonna do is that you go to the model section and in the template you just open you see already made template that already there and you, if you want if you don't want to customize yours you just take one from there and then fixing you know take one from there just like like this one and then change the name or some features or some element that you want to change you know to personalize it then you don't keep it but if you want to go on a longer process to know to customize it It's all about um, YouTube tools and all that. You got a lot of flavors going on on this channel that you're not gonna miss out. So make sure you keep the bell on so that you follow up on any goodies or anything I'm gonna put up for every week. Remember, I have new videos every week, so make sure you stick with me to follow up on whatever we're doing here. Keep in touch and keep watching, um, watching and keep enjoying yourself with this channel. You're not gonna regret it being part of this family. Thank you for your support and God bless you. And I want to use the opportunity to thank all my returning subscribers. I love you all and God bless you. I see you pushing up this channel. May God bless you and may God reward you abundantly. See you guys on the next video. Um...